video number three. Um, yeah, um, money video mom, mama, mommy. Why do I keep doing that? How can you not even remember your own name on you? That's insane. Okay, anyway, that's what happens when you have more than one kid. Your brain kind of melts away. I make that joke all the time. Every time I have another kid, I get a little dumber. Okay, see, I'm going to ask you guys a question. Because I know there are some, like, major resin folks out there and um i really do appreciate it when people leave helpful comments and let me know uh you know what what some good ideas okay so i tried something new because like i said before on my previous video we are on a really tight budget around here and so i can't spend the kind of money like everybody else you know seems to be able to do for their, excuse me for a second, Nevaeh, cut it down or close your door, sis. So, um, yeah. So, anyway, um, I, I made this, um, pendant, uh, whatever, and I, me and my daughter have been really trying to figure out ways to uh, make glow-in-the-dark stuff without buying that but expensive whatever whatever it is glow-in-the-dark powder iridescent iridescent holographic whatever you know what I'm talking about that that like thirty forty fifties put a mortgage up expensive but glitter or powder that you can order online. I really like it. I think it's fantastic. It's awesome if you can afford it and but we can't and I was really, really trying to find like a cheap and an inexpensive way to make some of her stuff glow in dark. This was one of those those tries. And as you can see it's got it was just clear resin and it has um pink Tinsel, um, glitter in it, and some like, I don't know if you can, I know you can see it like, like that, but, um, see, it's even got a pink hue to it. All the tinsel glitter kind of like fell forward because I just mixed it in earlier. I didn't want it to get tacky or nothing like that, but I th I kind of wanted it to be mixed in. But then we added. Because I found this at the store, and my Michaels had it on sale for like one ninety nine. I was like, yes. Then we used, oh no, not this. This is triple thick. What is that stuff? Crap. I think I left it downstairs. That is with the gloss that we use. I don't need that. I need, what is the name of that stuff? It's like Americana um, Glow in the Dark. Or something like that. And that's what it says on the front. I'll have to get it off. I'll have to do another video and show you guys. But it's the glow in the dark stuff. And we just kind of, it's white. And we just put a drop in our resin. We mix it up together with this. And we poured it. First of all, okay. We did this, I'd say, five days ago. It's been, like, popped out five days ago. If you can see that, look. It's still being. And it's actually a lot harder than it was, like, a couple of days ago. It's 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 heartening. It's just er, taking forever, which doesn't bother me. I'm not a I'm not one of those people like, oh my gosh, it's not hard. And I, it has to be hard because we do this for fun. And if somebody wants one, then we just fill it for super cheap. But, um, yeah, it it's still kind of bendy, which doesn't bother me. What bothers me is that, okay, you see that? Okay, I don't know. That there didn't mix all the way in. And it does glow in a dark. I don't know if I can. Okay, it might help if I take the. Yeah, here we go. Okay, see that? No, probably not. But it does glow. That's it glowing. That's not the white on it. But it does actually does glow in the dark, which is fantastic. The problem that I have is it's not that pretty. You know, it's not. I mean, it's okay. But it's really, oh, well, accidentally pushed that flash button again. Um, it's it's just not, 
I wanted to do more with it because her friends really like this. And I was thinking, what better way to keep your kids safe than to not buy those stupid sticks that actually, because around here, we, our trick-or-treat day or whatever, the way our, our, um, our town does it, is we have a parade on Halloween. So everybody trick-or-treats the day before Halloween and then gets puts their costume back on on Halloween and goes to the parade in our town. So our kids trick-or-treat for like two days in a row. So those things that you buy that goes around the wrist and the little light thingies or whatever, they're really great, but they only last for so long, you know, and these are something that you can reuse over and over and over again. So, yeah. So if you, so we like these because we, we want to pass them on to our friends and keep them and stuff and use on my girls when they trick-or-treat or whatever. And I was wondering, do you have any other alternatives or do you know where any glitters are? We've got Hobby Lobby and Joanne and Michaels. we got Michaels around the corner, but Hobby Lobby and Joanne aren't far. So please let me know when you see this video. And, yeah, sorry if it's, like, uber bored. I'm sorry, you guys. I keep pushing that stupid button in it. My my light goes on and off on my on my camera phone or whatever so yeah and we don't have a drill either i usually pull my resin out before it's really ready and while it's so soft i stick my pans in that's my secret oh and i gave it to you guys see how much i love you already no subscribers and i absolutely love the people that i don't know Okay, that's weird. Awesome. I'm going to stop now because that's all I really had to say. I hope you guys have a fantastically blessed day. And all right.